Remember that time Jordan Spieth won the Masters by four shots last year? Well, he's keeping it going and he leads the field by two shots following the first round. Spieth fired off a bogey-free six under 66 on Thursday, and this is his fifth straight round he has held the lead at the Masters. Paul Casey teed it up with Jordan and following his round said, I was impressed by everything. That was a flawless round of golf. He also said it was one of the toughest days he has seen at Augusta. Winds were reaching 25 miles per hour, but Danny Lee said at times it felt more like 50. His score did not reflect that, though. He is two off Spieth and T2 at four under. Unfortunately for Ricky Fowler, his round definitely reflected the tough conditions. Fowler shot an 8 over 80. It was looking like it would be a rough day after he opened his round with a double bogey on the first, but then he carded three birdies and things were looking up until he made the turn and shot 44 on the back nine. He will need to put it into gear on Friday if he wants to make the cut. Then there was Ernie Els, who six putted from two feet on the first hole. He matched Fowler's 8 over 80 in his own highest round ever at Augusta. And things started out well for Jason Day, but then they took a turn after he made the turn. Day was in hot pursuit of Spieth carding a 5 under 31 on the front nine, but then he went bogey, triple bogey, bogey on 15, 16, and 17 respectively to finish up T21 at even par. But we are only through the first round, so make sure to check back to PGATour.com for all the updates, and I will see you right back here for a brand new takeaway following the second round.